Welcome to 1242 Normandy Avenue in Irvine, California. This four bedroom, three bath, 1,878 square foot home was built in 1971 and it's for sale for $1,650,000. By the way, thanks for watching. My name is John Chesky, and if you need to reach out to me for any reason, all of my contact information is located in the description below, but here is my phone number on the screen, so if you want, you can just directly text me. In this video, I'm going to show you two things. First thing is that I'm gonna point out all of the highlights and stuff that I like or things you should be aware of. The second part is gonna be the POV walkthrough tour where you feel like you're actually here with me touring the home. All right, let's do this. Something I know you're gonna love about this house is that it has been completely remodeled, but the remodel is not just aesthetic, it's also practical. There's new things in the house, such as the pool pump and the water heater. One thing I love about this kitchen is that it is a double peninsula, or as I like to call it, a horseshoe. So you have main drag right here, and then you've got two wings that come out. It's very open, instead of having an island in the middle, but you kind of still have that island feel. And then you got the breakfast bar bench seating. That's my leather boots, that's not, I didn't toot. I'm not a tutor. I've never tutored in my life. It's a great pool, everything's been redone. I love how this wall is so tall. You don't even need a diving board, you can jump off of this entire thing, which I think is just a really fun concept for a pool or Tony Hawk's Pro Skater. When you're buying a house, it's important to focus on the actual bones and shape of the house, not the stuff that's in it. That said, when a house is staged properly, it is inspiring. Even if nothing in this house is your style, it should give you a good idea of how you would customize this house for you. For example, this room is staged as an office, but you could make it into a recording studio, you could make it into a painting studio, uh, a, a mini media room of some sort, or you can just be totally square and make it into a bedroom. And yes, I did go back to my car to get my hat. I need a haircut. <laughs> Fantastic primary bedroom. Not too big, not too small. Vaulted ceilings with recessed lighting, a modern fan, and a really nice BBB. A bold black beam. Little finishing touches like hardware that they use throughout the entire house. It's uh, a consistent theme and it's, it's just, it's a nice little extra touch that they chose good hardware because it just makes the house stand out that much more. Yeah, they definitely did a good job with the remodel, making things feel modern, especially this cozy primary bathroom. That was the toilet creaking, not the leather, but it's definitely not me tooting. Maybe you wouldn't hang this particular piece up, I would, I love it. But it's just inspiring for you to say, if I bought this house, well, not even if I bought this house, even in my own house that I currently have, if I just love a room, if I give it some attention, either make something myself, buy something from a friend, or order a photography piece like this from the artist, and just, just love a room. Another good example of consistency in the remodel of this house, they chose good hardware. For example, this FF, fancy faucet. I love a fancy faucet. Where's the water even come out? All right. I just wanted to take a moment to thank Jenny Chaidez for allowing me to show her listing to you guys.
brand new pool stuff right there. That pump, that's a newer one. Three car garage, three car garage. Brand new water heater right there. Thanks again for coming along on this tour with me. I hope you had as much fun as I did. If you'd like to know more about this house or buying or selling any real estate, go into the description below, click the Calendly link and book a free Zoom consultation with me and find out if you and I are a good fit.